The most preferred U.S. immigration advantage is the obtaining of a green card through marriage. However, a lot of people marry U.S. citizens in a fraudulent manner to obtain a green card, although such marriages are closely examined by the USCIS to ensure that these marriages are truly genuine. A close relative of a U.S. citizen or green card holder, any foreign spouse can have effortless access to the permanent residency, as compared to any non-related foreigner. The procedure for obtaining a green card for a spouse of a U.S. resident or citizen is described below. The very first step towards obtaining an alien resident status in the U.S. is the filing of USCIS Form I-130. The filing of this petition sets up the relationship of the foreign spouse to a U.S. resident. Plus the alien spouse who is seeking immigration, along with the U.S. resident required to submit all details about their biographic information, by filling out the form G-325A, both applicants have the onus to prove the bona fide of the marriage. So, apart from the submission of these forms, all the applicants are also having to submit proof of valid marriage, along with documents like marriage and birth certificates, wedding announcements, insurance and banking accounts, joint credit card statements, driver's license, and joint auto registration if available. You might need the services of a competent immigration attorney to help you with all this. The spouses of U.S. citizens apart from the I-325A and I-130 can file for the adjustment of status. For this they must submit the I-485 Affidavit of Support, Medical Report, EAD or Employment Authorization Document, the Advance Parole, the Related Photographs, and the Required Fees. Once this is over, the spouse should attend a biometric or fingerprint appointment. The next step is for the U.S. citizen and his, her spouse to attend an immigration interview at USCIS Service Center nearest to them. If all their documents are in order, they will be granted their permanent resident status after the interview, any immigration attorney will tell you. For the spouses of non-citizen U.S. residents, visa numbers can be had for the processing of the petition by the USCIS. Information on visa numbers is available with the U.S. Department of State travel site. If the alien spouse has children, they are required to apply separately for permanent residence. The separate I-130 must be sent together, with all other documents for them to be reviewed together. After going through all the information mentioned above, the process of obtaining permanent residency status or a green card is full of complications. Besides, the procedure can change from time to time. So, it is better hire an experienced immigration lawyer to successfully guide you through it all.